What's up guys, this is Mitch or DeHacker13 from jailbreakauthority.com and today I have iOS 7 untethered jailbreak news number two. Now a couple weeks ago I did make a video um, with the same title of this one except without the number two. It was just called iOS 7 untethered jailbreak news and all I did was give you guys some updates regarding the status of the untethered jailbreak for iOS 7 and I did get uh, pretty good feedback from that video so I thought I would make a second version of that video which is of course this one iOS 7 untethered jailbreak news number two. So I'll be doing the same thing as I did in my last one and that's it. That is pretty much just giving you guys some of the latest news regarding this iOS 7 untethered jailbreak. So anyways, let's get right on into it. Okay guys, so the first tweet I wanted to show you all was uh, Muscle Nerd's response to iPhone Steven and he posted this response to Twitter on October 22nd and he said, if you've already lost the jailbreak by upgrading to iOS 7, then yep, it's fine to go from 7.0 to 7.0.3. Now, you know, this tweet just confirms that uh, 7.0.3 is completely safe to update to um, regarding the iOS 7 untethered jailbreak. Um, you know, some of you guys may be thinking that Apple um, added this update to block some of the exploits that the evaders could be using. And Muscle Nerd is just confirming in this tweet that no, um, Apple is not doing that. They're just fixing some minor glitches. And 7.0.3 is completely fine to update to um, if you plan on jailbreaking your iOS 7 device as soon as the evaders release the tool. So iOS 7.0.3, completely safe to update to. Um, so the next tweet is from the Evaders Twitter account, <clears throat> and they said, still working hard on the iOS 7 jailbreak, but in the meanwhile, we're thinking about making Evaders hoodies. Any interest in buying anyway, one? This tweet was on October 29th, and so this is great because it isn't just one of the individual members of the team posting, you know, the status of the jailbreak. You know, it's the official Evaders Twitter account, and, you know, they just told everybody, um, and around two weeks ago, almost two weeks ago, that they are still working hard on this iOS 7 jailbreak, which is just awesome. So the next tweet is from Pimskex, and he did respond to this guy right here. Um, I'm not going to even try to pronounce his, pronounce his Twitter name, um, but he, this guy said uh, to Pimskex, Pimskex, unfortunately, iPhone 5S on iOS 7.0.3, the lock screen has been bypassed, and he posts a video, um, and Pimskex responded, oh, not again. Expect 7.0.4 in the near future. And this tweet, I know you guys may be wondering, how does this concern the iOS 7 until the jailbreak? And the way it does is <clears throat> you will, you guys will know if 7.0.4 does come out, then most likely it will just be Apple fixing this lock screen glitch that this other guy um, tweeted at Pimskex, Pimskex with. Um, so... Um, don't upgrade to 7.0.4 straight away if it does come out. You know, wait from confirmation from the Evaders or Muscle Nerd or Planet Being. Um, but you know, don't expect 7.0.4 to be you know Apple patching the jailbreak. You know, that's most likely not going to be it because this lock screen glitch has been detected as you can see here. Um, and so most likely 7.0.4 will come out fixing that, not patching the exploit from the jailbreak. But, you know, don't upgrade to it straight away because you never know um, what it could be. And, you know, just wait from evaders or any of the members of the evaders until you can update, you know, wait for their confirmation. Uh, so the next tweet is from Planet Being. And he said, really sick of the fake evaders.net comma evaders j underscore jb twitter account and their facebook and google plus pages spreading speculation that people think come from us and planet being posted this tweet on november 6th and basically he's this is just a rant tweet and he's saying that he hates all the fake uh, evaders jailbreak uh, websites and twitter accounts and he hates how there's lots of fake ios 7 jailbreaks out there and they're spreading false speculation about the evaders and so just remember guys um, you know the point of me showing you this tweet is only um, only believe information that you see from the official evaders account or any of the official accounts of the members of the evaders um, so don't trust anything from evaders.net or evaders underscore JB you know only pay attention to the trusted accounts um, so the very final tweet that I'll be showing you in this video and I think it um, is the perfect tweet to show at the end of the video. 
um, and it is from Pimskex, and he posted this tweet on November 8th, and he said, and yes, we, in parentheses, um, at Evaders, are still working hard on the iOS 7 jailbreak. Just be patient. Now, uh, the reason why I think this is the perfect tweet to end off this video is because um, just be patient. That part of the tweet is my message to you guys, to the people who are viewing this video. Um, I've seen on Twitter lots of people getting mad, getting impatient because they really want a jailbreak for iOS 7, and they're constantly posting tweets to the evaders and the members of the evaders saying, hey, when's this jailbreak going to be done? You know, hurry up. You guys aren't even working on it. And, you know, people just complaining. And really all that does is it wastes more time. Um, if you guys spend time posting tweets to the, to the evaders or any member of the evaders, um, you know, asking when the jailbreak's going to be done, you know, what's the status of it, really it's just going to be wasting more time. Um, so instead of the evaders actually working on the jailbreak, they'll be spending maybe an hour or so a day uh, reading, you know, tweets from you guys, or not necessarily you guys, but just anxious iOS 7 users, um, you know, people who are really anxious for the jailbreak, and, you know, um, it, it wastes time. So, you know, just be patient, uh, just wait on iOS 7 or iOS 6 if you're like me. Don't post a whole bunch of tweets to these guys asking when the jailbreak's gonna be finished, you know, just be patient and wait, because as Pimskek says in this tweet, they are still working hard on the iOS 7 jailbreak. The evaders are. Um, so that's pretty much it for the video, guys. Please follow me on Twitter um, at TheHacker13. I'll have a link in the description down below. Uh, follow me, you know, because I'll be posting updates on the iOS 7 jailbreak as well. And also, don't forget to subscribe to me, um, which is this channel, The Hacker 13 because I will be posting more updates like this in the future. And as soon as the iOS 7 jailbreak does come out, I'll be posting a tutorial. But that's pretty much it for the video, guys. Click the like button, leave a comment down below, and like I said, please subscribe. Um, thanks for watching the video, and I will see you all in my next one.